Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin1913, and we are Let's Play Dragon Quest V, Hand of the Heavenly Bride. In the last episode, we uh, explored Cogburn and a little bit of Wheelbrook. I apologize about that. I will go back and check it out later. Anyways, uh, we're, there's a lot of great items there. Anyways, we uh, picked up a couple items here and there, and now we're actually going to go and head off to another area down memory lane and I do apologize for doing this but we do get some nice stuff so that's why I'm doing it so uh, yeah it's gonna be a lot of fun now onward onward there we go and yeah it's gonna be a lot of fun we're going to do where are we heading to now let's see I'm going to head to Roundbeck Whee! Roundbeck. And in Roundbeck, there is, honestly, nothing really here. But I figured I'd come back just for memory's sake. And, uh, pretty much hear about what, what my kids and Sancho did while they were, uh, searching for me. Yeah, and apparently the Order of Zugzwag will save anybody who needs saving, I guess. And, uh, from the Grandmaster of the Underworld. Which is kind of interesting. Yeah, he did run away. I, I do remember him being a, uh... Yes, this is where we, we saved Percy back in the day. It would be pretty cool to find another Saber Cat, but it's probably not going to happen. Anyways. Yeah, cook nice meals for your son and hope for the best. Or your kids and hope for the best. That sounds like an alright strategy, I guess. You know, that's all you can do. It's honestly all you can do. But yeah, I guess it's kind of interesting to come back here. And yeah, this woman is pretty much... You remember that bunny girl that we... We met back in the day. Well, now she's an older lady. Yeah, let's go talk to him. Pick your brain. Let's hear what my kids have to say about your legend. Yep, I have three. I have two of them. Yeah, he was defeated a while ago. And yeah, one thing I did come back here for is remember that we gotta come over here later. When we eventually find our next key. So let's look around. Yep. Well, you're looking at him. You look at him, he's got blonde hair, he's, he's about to go Super Saiyan, or I guess he already is at that point. Let's talk to this innkeeper here. Oh shit, you guys are, you guys are, you're paying the order of Zugs one? Wow, that's, that's bad. These people have given up. It's like the Zug, Order of Zugs one is sort of like uh, one of them, uh, one of them freaking uh, telev TV televangelist people. Yeah, I don't think there's anyone here. Maybe that's why this place is doing so crappy. You got this really nice inn, but no one's here anymore. No one's here. Let's get the hell out of here. This place is a dump. Alright, so pretty much that's about it for Roundbeck. I might never come back here again. Alright, let's continue. We're going to head back to Upton Towers. Yes, I know. It's crazy. 
Oh, we got new enemies. Hoodlum and Jowler. Uh, yeah. Let's try this out. Man, that's not that good. That's actually awful. Oh, wow. i never seen that happen. He just attacked his buddy. And there we go. Alright, let's keep moving here. And this is, I swear to Crib, this is the last time I come here. Yes, we did. Yeah. Well, yeah, who knows what they have here, anyways. But yeah, let's go and see if we can find, um... Let's go and see if we can find the king. So I can get the Uppetan crown. I don't know, maybe he'll be in his throne room. That's what I'm thinking. Maybe he's in the throne room. Yeah, the ghost isn't here anymore? The ghost of the inn? That's weird. Where the hell are they? I'm honestly surprised there hasn't been people, like, trying to renovate this place. You know, that's another thing I want to talk about. I meant to talk about it when we got to Wheelbrook, but I guess I could talk about it now. Is, you know, Cogburg, they pretty much burnt down Wheelbrook and pretty much killed a bunch of people. Which is pretty effed up. And so Harry was supposed to right the wrongs. But at this point, Harry has not even started to, like, fix up Wheelbrook. Like, at this point, no one is helping fix the town up that they destroyed. Isn't that crazy? Sure, he had a kid. Sure, he's helping out his brother. But, uh, he's not... Hmm, where are those people? But he's not really making an impact. Where are those people? Weird. Yeah, where are they? Yeah, let's go up up, up to their uh, grave. Maybe that, maybe that'll explain something. But yeah, you'd figure that the goddamn uh, you would figure that someone would be rebuilding Wheelbrook. You get a couple of houses fixed, but no, they're still living in caves, which I think is pretty messed up. If you ask me. Alright, what is this? Whose number is up, yeah. And yeah, she's down for the count. Alright, I've got an idea. Let's do TikTok. Okay, hopefully they're here. Yeah, but I, I was pretty strong back when I was a kid. I was able to handle ghosts. Hmm. Where are they? Oh, look. Here we go, finally. I don't understand why you guys aren't at rest. Why doesn't Pancrance appear to you? That's kind of an interesting question, Sancho. You would figure he was a spirit that, like, had uh, some sort of connection to this world. Yeah, there was a young couple. They're going to the Order of Zugzwan. What, is everybody going there? Yeah, that's the tea set I got. And I put it together and I shined it back up. Yeah, I'll let you have the tea set. And he's going to give me the crown of Upton. 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 Whatever. Upton. So, yeah, we got it now. Yeah, maybe you guys should rest. But, yeah, you figure that, now that I'm thinking about it, 
Pancrance's spirit should probably be, like, hanging around too. Especially when he still has a connection to the world. That is interesting. Can you imagine having Ghost Dad around with you? And not the Cosby Ghost Dad, like a really cool Ghost Dad. Helping you out. And maybe infusing you with power. Or even, like, in infusing his spirit of his own sword. That'd be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Alright, so now that we have another knickknack, which, if you wanted to, you could use that helmet, or that crown, as a helmet. It, it, it is plus 30 uh, defense, so that's not bad. But, I'm not going to bother because I'm just going to put it in the knickknackatorium. Yeah, the curator here, he's alright. Let's see if he'll pay me. No, he's still sleeping. I think what you need to do is talk to him during the day, and he'll mention something about having something, and then he'll be like, oh, you talk to him at night, he'll give you money. I think that's how it works. But yeah, so we put the bat and battle here, and we have the horn, and now I want to place, uh, what did I get, that monster chest set? Where is that? The monster chest set. We want to put it here. And yeah, look at it. It's pretty cool. And then... Nope. Let's see here. I don't think I want that ink... That tusk tusk thing there. Because I think that's a 10. And a 10 go... Double digits go upstairs, I think. We're almost done filling out the bottom of this thing. What do we need? One, two, three. Three more things down here. And how much stuff do we have to fill up here? Well, we're already putting two things. So yeah, we're getting close to the end here. We have almost all the knickknacks. Yeah, put this thing over here. And then put the crown over here. And there we go. Look at that, how cool. We'll eventually have to come and take some of these knickknacks off to do some stuff later, but... Yeah. Getting some good stuff, so... We only got four plus three is seven plus one upstairs is eight. So eight more knickknacks to grab. And I think three of them you can only get post game. I think. So there we go. We got everything in order. Now where are we going to head to? Let's see. Hmm. Where can we head to now? Oh, Fortune. No, Load Lodestar Harbor. Right, because I want to head into one place. Now, this place you really don't have to come back to, but I'm going to. You really don't have to go back to this place. But yeah, you remember that village? Hey. Hey. We're gonna we're gonna go in we're gonna go in hay. And you know what? I want to put Bar I want to put Barongo in the group or Percy or whatever. I want to see what they'll say when I bring in my saber cat friend again. Let's see what's gonna they're gonna say. They're gonna shift their pants. Oh, Percy isn't even here. What the hell? All right, so there's really not a lot for me to do here. I just want to come here and go. Ha ha! I'm right. You look funny. What do you mean? You? I look funny. Funny like a clown? Do I amuse you? Yeah, so apparently these people are having a bumper crop. How nice for them. These people are not affected by the end of the world coming at all. Which is good, because you need pockets of the world like this.
Uh, it means citizens. I don't know. These people are so backwards. Well, no, not that they're backwards. They're very, they're very country. And no, I haven't come to plow. What have I said? I was here to plow. Cod swallow. Yeah, they, they got interesting words. All right, so let's talk to some people. Yep, yep. I remember that. I was the guy. Yep, that was us. That was me. Yeah, you ostracized me. That was not nice. So yeah, this guy now feels sorry for being such a dick to me. And then, and then these people finally realize also, yeah, time heals all things. Yeah, at least he understands me. Yeah, it was, it was kind of mean because they're like, you know, oh, you're friends with the beast. Yeah, he never did none of the villagers harm. And he wasn't a wicked beast, that's right. Pretty much I came back in here to finally see these people... These people frickin', you know, eat their own words. That I wasn't a bad guy. And, I, and, you know, it was only coincidence that I even met Percy here. I mean, I don't even know how the hell he got over here on boat or you swim. But anyways, he's here now, he's in my group, and he's my friend. Alright, so here I am in, uh, Zoomingale, or Dale, or whatever the hell it's called, but, uh, pretty much we're gonna go visit, uh, the old, old guy. I can't remember, Toilin' Trouble. We're gonna go visit him. Maybe we can, uh, maybe he's found some other research, maybe? Yeah, why does he have water? I don't get it. Well, Isaac, he means he wants booze. He wants booze so that he can get drunk off his A. And why does he want to get drunk? Because he doesn't want to feel feelings anymore. And why doesn't he want to feel feelings anymore? Well, I don't know. I'm not going to delve into his own life. So sorry, Isaac. Yeah, you gotta take it slowly, although I know my way around now, so I don't have to worry. So let's come in here, and... What the hell, you're laying down. Oh, really? Pocus Pocus. Yeah. Oh, and poor Toil in Trouble. He's pretty much done, man. I feel bad for him. No, it's not a powerful spell. Although, I guess it could be. But it is awful. It's pretty much that chance spell that you get. And chance, I've always found to be pretty shitty. I've never had it do anything good for me. So now I learned this a spell that I'm probably never going to use, because I hate it. It costs 20 MP to use. I never like those random chance things anyways. So I won't be using it. Screw it. But I did get a new spell, so that's cool. Meow. Yeah, it's too, it's too bad he can't... He's getting really old. Yeah, never saw a ta talking cat. I've seen a driving cat. His name was Tootsies. So yeah, let's just check out the town just a little bit more. Alright. 
I'm actually gonna go in and come back out. Cause it'd be easier than freaking. uh... Yeah, it'll be easier. Let's go talk to those people there on top of the building. Hello. Yeah. Yeah, I feel bad for him. I mean, he's working and working and working. Oh, yeah, that's true. That must be true. If they, if they finish that goddamn thing that I built, that I was helping build <coughs> goddamn slavery shit. And yeah, Coral, the Order of Zugzwak, and yeah, for 3,000 gold, I don't have the money right now. But maybe I'll have it later. I'll have to come back and buy it. So apparently that lady's being like a... Like when them people go door to door, trying to sell you books. Excuse me, do you have a minute to talk about God? No. No, I don't. Get out of my face. Alright, so next place we're going to head off to is... Uh, let me see... I guess we'll head here. But we're not going to go into this village yet. I do not want to start this quest yet. So we'll hold off on going in there. Let's get in our ship. Now if we come over here, and we go to Stock and Barrel, we can actually get... Yeah, Isaac took a beat in there. But yeah, if we head into Stock and Barrel here, we can actually uh, do a couple other things. And the trees are saying hello. And oh, they apparently know that Mr. Whitaker already lives here. Very interesting. Yeah, the cat is enjoying it. Yeah, I guess the air is pretty nice. Yeah, you don't have to be a king. I mean, it'd be, it'd be nice if you became the king, but you don't have to become a king. And that's just a church there. Someone stole your clothes, eh? We'll have to look for the person who stole them. But yeah, one thing I want to mention is... If you came here... Well, no, maybe I'll explain a little, a little bit later. I may explain in the next episode. So let's, uh... We'll come, we'll come back here and check all this stuff later. Let's go through here. Now this guy here, he's still building or something. I, don't, I actually, honestly don't know what the hell he's doing. Well, uh, she's already in danger. I don't know where she is. Do you have any weird sixth sense? I might be able to tell me where the hell she is. Hey, it's this guy again. Kandar! I wish that's what they named them, Kandar. Alright, so for this, we're gonna do Oomph, and we're gonna do Kabuff. Sophie goes up. Very nice. Ooh, Kassap. Good. That's going to be very useful. And bye-bye. 
Let's see what we have here. Oh, Silk Bustier. Which is pretty much a little bit... I think it's a little bit better for any lady, but I'm not giving it to my kid. That's creepy. Anyways, I'm going to stop the video here. In the next episode, we are going... Yeah, no brand climbing. Anyways, in the next episode, we're going to continue exploring this place. Check out a few more places and then actually continue with the story. So this has been Genshin 1913. See you later. Bye-bye.